go. How is it going today? Hello, this is Kermit Zwayne. My name's Jazz. We're doing Jazz, so we have Iron Fist versus Poe. Poe? I thought oh. I was going to say Poe. You said Poe. <laughs> I never saw, I never saw Kung Fu Panda. <laughs> I, <laughs> it said it looked like Poe. Poe has two O's. Who says Poe has two O's? English? <laughs> Why can't one of the O's be taken off? Two got, so it's two. Wait, 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 wait. We about to get into it now because you about to piss me off. Two, T-O-O. -O, yeah. But then we got number two, T-W-O. And I'm then saying, we got two. Okay. Two, T-O. But this can't be poo. Using your same logic you just said, how come that can't be poo? <laughs> saying that it can't be poo either. I'm mm -hmm. saying it can be poo because poo. But poo <laughs> has two O's. But two got two O's too. Right. So you don't see two O's there. I'm, I'm just saying, saying in English. Doesn't make sense, okay? Certain things about English. How three different words that mean three different things, all, they all had to get that same word and come make them another one? Like, do? You act like I wrote the dictionary. I'm just saying, know. they come, oh yeah, I want two. No, you can't have two. The yes, I can. Video. Let me add a W to it. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm, <laughs> I'm sorry. All right. You don't get mad at me like I'm an English teacher. Poe. Yes, Poe, that's his name. <laughs> oh, I didn't watch the movie, obviously. <laughs> Death Battle. God. Let's dive on it. Oh, wait, if you guys have read your glass, please follow us on our social medias in the link in the description below. Don't forget to subscribe. Let's dive on it. Let's go, man. <laughs> Marvel's immortal Iron Fist. And Poe, the chosen Kung Fu Panda. Hey, yeah, you look. Poe. But these two <laughs> unlikely Jeez. masters have shown that with the right training and determination, anyone can walk the path of the Dragon Warrior. He's whiz and I'm I really kind of hope that and it's our job to analyze that weapon. He is. He's like, he, to find out who I don't I think he's going to win. I think he's going to win for sure. I hope that he wins. Every ten years in the mountains of Tibet, the mystical lost city of Kunlu <clears> will appear, forever guarded by a legendary warrior, the Iron Fist. Naturally, one of the Iron Fist's former apprentices, <laughs> Wendell Ran, thought, I should really bring my wife and kid to visit the Kung Fu Super City. Best family vacation ever! But not so really? naturally, Wendell's business partner tagged along, Harold Meacham. Who, yeah, he, surprise, he, he. had less than noble intentions. Yeah. So Wendell was sent off a cliff, and his son Danny won the tragic backstory lottery when his mom died protecting him from wolves. Damn. Never trust the Herald, folks. Wait, 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 wait. Another rat. Why does everybody's parents gotta die? Damn. That's why I'm laughing. He says tragic, tragic, tragic superhero. Superhero backstory. Wait, everybody's like, parents gotta die? In every anime and superhero. It's very rare that you see two parents. Okay? Why can't they just be chilling? And, like, what? and if if you do have two parents that are alive, the dad is never there. Oh, he's always then, on a business trip. Right, he's always on a business trip. And then the mom is there, and you got to take care of your mom. And then later on, your mom dies. Because a villain decides right. to go. <laughs> <laughs> so, <laughs> go or your mom gets sick or something. Like your that. mom's There's sick, something a villain happens. kills her later on, your dad is just out of the pit. You know what? Let's, let's not I don't know. know. You just said I have a parent. <laughs> 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 This may be like you with these superpowers, but you gotta sacrifice your parents. Oh, give me the give me the power. Bye, mom. Aikido pressure points pretty much every cool fighting style around. He also gained a weird habit of shouting "Heart of the Dragon" whenever he's surprised. Oh, you know that guy's got at least like six silver Heart of the Dragon. That's a lot. When Danny turned 19, he had the chance to become the next Iron Fist. But he had to overcome one final A dragon? Challenge, the immortal dragon, Shu Lao. And like a badass, Danny walked up to Shu Lao's front door. Then, get this, bear hugged the dragon until it felt unconscious, netting Danny a sweet chest tattoo and the chance to plunge his hands deep into the dragon's boomstick. What? I was gonna say the creepy cauldron holding its heart. Yo, I gotta, I gotta see what these are. These comedy writers were thinking, he said, well, you know what, instead of fighting the dragon, we're gonna hug it. He's gonna get his cool tattoo. His newfound power, Iron uh. Fist did what any vengeful orphan would, and left Kun Loon to track down the bastard who right. killed his parents. However, when yes, he sir. found Harold, all the Iron Fist saw was a broken man. Oh. So, he spared him, casting aside his past anguish to become a hero. Oh, great, another lesson about how revenge is bad and all that crap. Whiz, <laughs> when I find those chickens that did it, my grandpappy, make sure I finish the job. I'll put it on my calendar. Thanks to his friend, Luke Cage, Iron Fist mm -hmm. was able to reconnect with the real world and co-found a team, the Heroes for Hire. And when he wasn't super Iron Luke Fist Cage was Power actually Man. a pretty good dude who used his money to start a soup kitchen because he's yet another 
another superhero who is secretly a billionaire by inheritance. Together, the heroes for hire fought many villains, like Incinerator, Master Khan, and the White Man. Hell yeah! The white Down man. with the establishment, Danny! <laughs> no, I think they fought a mob boss actually named White Man. Well, Whitey better watch out, because <laughs> Iron Fist isn't just a fancy title. <laughs> Sorry, this episode got me one of the funniest that we've done. They literally fought. <laughs> you know, they, you know, it was popular in the seventies. You know, it had to be in the seventies. You job turkey. You know, <laughs> down with the establishment. <laughs> Yo, all right, all right, come on, come on, come on. You can call him something else. Right. He was definitely a pimp. He's on pimp duty. Have on with the cake. Oh my lord. Powers were learned through the aptly named Book of the Iron Fist, a relic that has been held by every past, the Iron Fist. It even lets Danny open portals across dimensions back to Kun Loon. Yeah, that's cool and all, but why does he wear ballet slippers? Yellow dance shoes don't exactly strike fear into the enemy, you know? They're Tai Chi shoes, pretty standard. Anyway, Iron Fist can absorb not just oh cheap, but all manner of naturally occurring power, like electromagnetism. Yeah! Oh, so that's why he wears the slippers. Danny can react in a microsecond, punch apart a hammer helicarrier, and has delivered mm -hmm. strikes comparable to hydrogen bombs. And being the Iron Fist, he is also one of the most martially skilled heroes in all of Marvel. This mm -hmm. guy can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with Boy Scout super soldiers like Captain America and the friendly neighborhood light-dodging Spider-Man. He even defeated the evil demon Mara. No, no, not the ball demon. Oh. I'm talking about the ball oh. demon. That's, that's the persona that version. That was that thing that you had to fight. Yes, was like, bro. Why is it like a, like a so thing? Yeah, 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 yeah. That yeah. had enough force to, and I quote, <laughs> make Hiroshima Man, look you. like a sparkler. Um, not so sensitive analogy aside, it's clear Iron Fist, Fist, Glum, Close Hand has some serious power. <laughs> One time he took in the chi of all the people of Kung Lu to become this red Kung Fu skeleton man. Watch out, he's got a foe to pick with crime. All to fight an eldritch terminator called The One, mm. who Danny had previously defeated. Wish you really need to work on words better. Anyway, after Iron Fist threw the nameless robot off a cliff, it found Danny Wendy himself and decided, Hey, I should really take this guy's head and plop it onto my body. What the f***? Who wrote this? <laughs> that aside, Iron Fist is one of the deadliest Marvel heroes out there. No matter the challenge, he Did will he always just kill be there Cap? Did that? It look like he's trying to outside world the iron fist we no saw that, that take that from me yep. not even you yeah! hey you saw they didn't even show any clips from the show yeah probably would get in trouble for it. maybe maybe i'm back a lot of it's on like what hbo max now deadly in martial arts that his foes would go it's blind like, from overexposure or, or disney no, no, no. plus one of those one of those apps <laughs> man they all run into each other this is Zhao Po Ping, a panda born in the Valley of Peace. Mm -hmm. For the longest time, this valley only knew, well, peace. peace right? But everything mm -hmm. changed when Gary Oldman the Peacock and his army attacked. Lord Shen received a prophecy saying his conquest would be stopped so by a warrior of Shaolin, black and white mm -hmm. of the panda. So, in a fit of paranoia, Shen decided to genocide so every panda in existence. Dang. Forcing Poe's mom to part with her baby as mm -hmm. he poses the way in a reddish box. Jeez, we got real dark for the sequel, huh? Mm -hmm. After Damn. some obligatory drama, Poe was yeah, taken in by a literal father goose named Ping. With his expert yeah. guidance, Poe trained day and night to be a waiter at a noodle restaurant. Not <laughs> the hardline warrior life I was expecting. It was Poe's dream to be a martial artist. He idolized all things Kung Fu, going so far as to make action figures of his heroes. The Furious Five. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. However, he never expected to have the chance to actually explore that dream. Mm -hmm. Until the day of the Dragon Ceremony, where yeah. Master Wei would select a chosen one to lead a new era of Kung Fu as the Dragon Warrior. The and to the King. shock of everyone, Master Wei chose him! Talk about a freak accident! There are no accidents, Boonstick. Despite hmm. some setbacks, Poe was actually quite gifted. He just needed the right motivation. Which was uh, food. on a stick. Or hmm. more accurately, a dumpling. dumpling. Next to the Furious Five, Poe experienced the classic Shaolin animal styles, which are actual practice martial arts. Tiger mm -hmm. style uses ferocious combos. Monkey style has unpredictable acrobatics. Mm -hmm. Mantis style uses fast strikes. Viper style implements fluid movement. And Crane style is all about sweeping hits. But none of them suited. 
Info. So he made his own. You guessed it, Panda Style. Which is sort of inspired by the real world Dragon Style, but mostly based around using his roundness for defense, mm -hmm. wearing down enemies until he gets an opening. His body can stop just about anything. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> pressure point attacks, and even a club to the face. When he isn't overwhelming you with his pure fatness, Poe can launch a Hadouken with a thundering wind hammer, immobilize foes with a paralyzing shoulder touch, and blind you with the Golden Lotus Clap! So he has his own thunder clap. Standing with you. Could blind yourself. <laughs> what? Why wasn't that at the beginning of the instructions? I never saw Poe do this in the movies. Poe is much more than movies, like TV shows, where he picked up a lot of new powers. I didn't watch the TV. Heroes cheat, a life force passed on to a chosen every generation. This shonen power up lets Poe counter mind control, shoot beams of energy, and make a giant dragon construct that devours pretty much anything. Wow. And of course, possessing the hero's chi makes Poe comparable to the previous owners of it, including the Black Tortoise, who was powerful enough to stop this huge meteor from hitting Earth. Poe even defeated this dude who would absorb the collective chi of the greatest fighters across China. Poe's achievements gave him the admiration of his peers, but his journey to becoming a legend wasn't easy. Yeah, big shocker, the orphan pan a dragon warrior raised by a goose in a noodle shop had a bit of an identity crisis. But through it all, Poe proved he can hang with the best of them. He can evade lightning blasts, chuck a hammer into low orbit, and once cleared an entire cloud formation with just the flex of his pinky. This is his signature Jeez. technique, the Wuxi finger hold, mm -hmm. a move that warps anyone caught in it to the spirit realm. Yeah. Hey, hey, the afterlife. You gotta watch it, you, you gotta watch it. The characters who have canonically died can't be found here. And even should Poe be unable to complete the hold, he can always use it on himself to bring his target to the spirit realm with him. But despite the spirit realm being the afterlife and all that, death isn't always permanent. I mean, thanks to Poe's chi mastery, he can travel back home no problem. And eventually, he overcame the tragedy of his past and found his inner peace. In this state of mind, Poe has, has an immense amount of focus, enough to catch cannonballs. A trick that proved handy when it came time to defeat that asshole Gary Oldman. Yeah, uh, uh, yeah. Maybe. <laughs> we only go to the afterlife, like... Uh, Poe. Poe now stands ready to teach the next generation, alongside his original father, who apparently survived, head and all. What a nice ending. After mastering Chi, returning from the spirit realm, and saving all the children. He went to that life and got him, we saw. That's probably the last movie I didn't see. I am the Dragon Warrior. Get it? See the giant dragon? <laughs> <laughs> you know who that is. Yeah, Jack Black, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm like, that boy sounds happy familiar. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Mm -hmm. Oh, wow. 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 O
Yeah, and punch him back. Opening, making this the exact kind of match he would excel in. Not to mention, mm -hmm. Poe's wooshy finger hold was an instant win, right? Well, right. kind of. As long as he had the book of the Iron Fist, he could theoretically make a portal out of the spirit realm. Assuming Poe didn't eat him first. <laughs> <laughs> Remember, after hmm. coming to terms with his conflicting emotions and returning from the spirit realm, Poe had gained true mindfulness. Not unlike the path to enlightenment taken to achieve Nirvana. Man, mm. that's some heavy stuff for a cartoon bear voiced by Jack Black. Right. Right. Otherwise, <laughs> Poe can move between the mortal realm and the afterlife at will, making it questionable if death by conventional means even matters to even him. Even means anything. And anyway, against Poe's overwhelming toughness, counters and back. power, <laughs> Iron Fist wasn't putting him down uh... in the first place. <clears throat> he just didn't have the stomach to bear it. <laughs> the winner is Poe. It seemed like a really good movie. I'll definitely it's check it out. Movie. Next time. Oh, Steven! Steven! Steven from Steven mm -hmm. Universe? Okay. I don't know who that is. <laughs> I, Star, Star Butterfly. Butterfly. Okay. I don't, I'm sorry, I don't know, I don't know who Star actual. Butterfly is, but um, I, don't know <laughs> I heard, I never watched Steven Universe. I heard Steven that was universe. good. Yes. Yeah. Um, I didn't watch the whole entire, because it's long. It's, well, I'm going to say it's it long, long, but they have, they have a lot of episodes, and... They kind of, it's not like random stuff, like it's like a story that like continues and stuff. Oh, sort of. it's a linear story that, yeah. you, not with like filler, 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 they, oh yeah, here I we mean, go. I mean like they do like, they have like random occurrences and mm -hmm. stuff, but like some things do happen in certain episodes that make things happen later on, so that's why I'm just like, okay, I have to like sit and like uh, watch it episode to episode, but it's, it's a really good show. show. Okay. okay. It's a really good show. Oh yeah, I don't know none of those characters. <laughs> <laughs> so we can, we're gonna watch it though. We're gonna see who wins. I'll learn. I'll learn. I'll learn. I'll learn. I don't know nothing about the characters. Oh, okay. <laughs> you said who? 
I heard it was good though. I heard Steve, I heard the show was good. It is I just good haven't show. got time to watch it all the way yet. Mm -hmm. But yeah. Yeah. Anyway, um comment below guys, let's to forget to like subscribe.